Live by the sword. Live a good long time. I've got the best prices this side of Cormier. What is my task? It shall be. Do my best. I am ready. This is a lot more exciting than any circus. Speak your mind. You need something? As you arrive in the clearing, the first thing that draws your attention is the plume of smoke billowing from nearby Saradush. Its walls have been breached in several places, and its utter devastation shows a city that has been completely sacked by invaders. Bodies of soldiers are everywhere, as is the stench of death. The screams of the innocent attempting to flee can still be heard. Yagashura and his army are nowhere in your immediate sight. Yes? 
What is my task? On my honor. Shall be on my own. Consider it done. Nature, yeah. the life she gave. Taste my foot. Yes. I will do my best. I thought I would have to content myself with slaughtering all the weakling bones on this city and forgetting about me. But here you are. <laughs> I should have been the first sent after you, and now I shall prove it. Yagasura shall become even greater still. What is my task? Who says? What? On my honor. Very well. You have weakened me. You and that foul witch, I know it. No matter. Yagashura will defeat you yet. I greet you, you who are of divine blood. It is time for your education to continue. You have been brought to this place because you are ready, Gacha. The first step towards the fulfillment of your destiny has been taken. Yagashura is dead by your hand, and the forces in play now move swiftly toward conclusion. Now you must know yourself and your past to reveal the future. Listen, and be judged. To look upon oneself and ask, what is my nature? One must know one's origin. Your own origin is a mystery to you, God child. You have no beginning, and without a beginning, how can you be an end? What do you know of your birth? What do you know of your mother? Of your life before the Ryan got you to the safety of Kenny? Your past unfolds. You would do well to heed it closely. I am your mother. I am Aliana. A disciple. 
disciple of the great lord of murder, a priestess of Baal. In the time of troubles did Baal himself come and whisper in mine ear. I was to give birth to one of the children, to you. I rose my arms up and hailed my lord of murder with great joy at my fate. Others of Baal's order took me away to hide us in the darkest temple, away from prying eyes. Others of the children were there, and when our great Baal died, did we begin our task? The task was to slay her own child, sacrifice her babe upon the bloodiest of altars. I would slay you, my child, so Baal could live again. But I and several of my colleagues had discovered the location of this temple. We attacked and stopped your mother from performing the sacrifice. We resisted. This was the will of Baal, father of my child. They were many, and their magic was strong. We had little time. I killed the priestess. He slew me. Your mother! I rescued you and fled from the temple, even as many other Ballspawn babes died. But not all of us died. Some of us used the chaos to escape, to flee. Yes, not all the Ballspawn children died that night. I saved the only one I could. He could only save one. There was no time for more. But I was there as well. I chose you. I could not save both of you. He left me behind, saving you instead. And so I fled on my own. Raised by foster parents in the Iron Throne, it mattered not. I killed Grime in the end. And so your past is made plain. Your mother, a priestess of Baal, killed by Gorion. And what of your brother, Saravok? What if fate had not intervened, and Gorion had raised him rather than you? Would you have become as he was? Would Saravok be in your place now if but for the smallest twist of fate? Is there a debt between you, then, that is yet unpaid? We are finished, then, for now. Return to your cocoon plane. You will find part of it now open to you. Investigate as you wish. Consider what you have learned here today. Farewell, God Child. and return this way only to find the giant dead and you gone. My own escape was a narrow one. Once the walls were breached, Yagashura thundered through the city almost too quickly for us to react. I tried to get the ball spun out, but it was too late. Yagashura seemed to think you were in the city and was eager to seek you out. He slaughtered them all. There was nothing I could do.
What is my task? I await your word. We must rest soon. Who is getting squirrely? On my honor. Yes? Ugh, my legs are just... There's a lot of my life needed. Can we rest now? to stop and rest. What is my choice? As you ask. Yes. 
Very well. On my honor. To battle! I'm I have to try to write. What can I do? On my honor. Yes? To battle! Drop your item on the ground. It shall be. With cold steel. What is my task? Fall, creature, and feed the earth. I have to drop your item on the ground. On my honor. I have to drop your item on the ground. To battle and victory. You are a slippery one. Yes. Faster than Chick, take a fast pause. Yes. I had to drop your item on the ground. What is my task? Consider it done. I had to drop your item on the ground. On my eye, wait your word. on the ground. On my honor. Great fun! Yes? What is my task? Feel the back hand You are a slippery one! battle and victory! I have to drop your item on the ground. This is a lot more exciting than any circus. On my arm. Yes. What is my task? Very well. Pay for your sins! For your lands and home! On my honor. To battle <gasps> and victory! <laughs> yes, done. <laughs> what is 
my task. To battle and victory! A dangerous mistake. On my own, as you ask. This side of Cormier. Yes? Yes. Dust blows around you, clearing a moment later to reveal what can only be Amkethron, a village nestled into an outcropping of rock amidst a desert so dry and sparse of life that you wonder how such a place could survive. Dominating the village, and seemingly carved out of the stone face of the rocks themselves, is a large and ornate fortress, its purpose unknown. Anything else I can make? Ooh. 